Hi everyone, this is Pretty Grumpy Bear. In this video, I'll go great lengths to extract every single bit of details from the new Five Nights at Freddy's 3 teaser trailer. I have already turned the trailer into 1,575 images so we can see every detail clearly. Now let's get started. The trailer starts by showing us a wall with many animatronics drawings. The first one is Freddy. The second one is Creepy. There is a mysterious creature in this drawing. It could be a different version of Chica. It has the orange beak. But it has pink hair, pink fur around its shoulder. And I'm not sure if the kids forgot to draw its legs, or it just doesn't have any legs. Then we have two posters. Next to it we have old Barney with a cupcake. Below there is toy Barney. We know it's toy Barney because it has those red cheeks. Toy Chica is next to them. There is also the drawing of the marionette. It's using both hands to lift the lid of the box. And then there is a third limb in the middle. I guess it's just a black string that ties the box. The screen starts to dim at this point so it's not easy to see what's drawn on the last few pictures. We can guess this one is the balloon boy. We can't see his face clearly but we can see the balloons. And there's something resembles a propeller on his head. So it's probably him. The next two are even weirder. This one is light purple in color. But it has a top hat. So, Bonnie with a top hat? The other one is even more blurry. But we can tell it's brown in color. And it has long ears. But not like bunny ears. More like dog ears. Sparkly the dog? It can be. That character is fan-made. Actually, it looks like it has four ears. Two dog ears and two wolf ears. It seems to be wearing a pink dress as well. Not a clue. Moving on. There's a message. He will come back. Not sure who this he is referring to. After that, the trailer showed us another part of the horror attraction. It's decorated like the old diners, with pizzas and posters on the wall, stars hanging from the ceiling. In the middle, there is a blinking blue screen. It could be an arcade, this machine-shaped like one. Here's another message. He always does. Same message as on SkyGames.com right now. Our three-star animatronics make an appearance. Here, Bonnie's eyeball slowly moves, Ended up staring at the camera. For whatever reasons, we can't see Freddy's eyeballs. Maybe it's just because of the camera angle. These three animatronics are identical to the ones in Five Days at Freddy's 1. They are not newly designed or repaired version of the withered animatronics in Five Days at Freddy's 2. Here comes another message. We have a place for him. Who are we? Okay, the focus of the trailer is here. The new animatronic is sitting in the corner of the pizzeria slash horror attraction. It's twitching creepily, showing that it's malfunction. I have a separate video analyzing this particular animatronic, so I won't go into details here. You can check it out first. I'll do a quick sum up here. This is a hybrid animatronic with Bonnie's ears, Golden Freddy's suit, robotic eyes, and human hands because it has five fingers. Well, the title screen. Five Nights at Freddy's 3. And at the end, we have a glimpse of the new office. Broken and dirty. The lighting is green in color. A classic horror movie lighting choice. Two drawings on the right hand side of the wall. The upper one is the Bonnie with a top hat. The lower one is the mysterious four ears dog again. Below that is our office desk. Freddy, Bonnie and Chica's figurines are on it. And a beverage cup with the same design as 30 years ago. There's a trash can, but still, no phone is available in the office. The new office has a giant window in the middle. But it could also be a mirror, because look at the fan. It's facing our side. If this is a window, it would be on the other side of the room facing a window, which doesn't make sense. So I think it's a mirror. 
The fan is actually next to us. The guard. We can also see a fan in the mirror, which means that fan should be behind us. Two more pictures on the mirror. One is Bonnie. The other one could be Golden Freddy because the color is yellowish. When we turn to the left, we see the box of scrapped animatronics from the teaser image. We can't see everything, but there is Toy Bonnie's guitar, Mango and Mango and Chica's shells, and Toy Freddy's top hat. There is also another fence near the ceiling. Two more posters, and the new animatronic is already in your office. After we turn all the way to the left, we see a door. Sorry, no door, just a door frame. Because why would they give us doors? Screw us, right? There's no door. From there, we can see there is an empty animatronic suit outside. That looks a lot like Freddy. Brown color, black bow tie, black nose, and black eyebrow. He also has similar pose as one of the Freddy's old image, but he doesn't have two buttons on his body, and his teeth are closer together. This animatronic appears to be approaching us. Even though it makes a really loud jump scare noise, I don't know if it's trying to hurt us because it's just slowly walking towards us. His action is not very aggressive. He could be after something other than your life. Okay, this is the end of this analysis. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment below. Tell me your thoughts on the new teaser trailer or tweet me. My Twitter handle is at PGB Game. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any Five Days at Freddy's three videos, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.